Rutherford and Son is a play written in 1912 by Geetha Sowerby. She was hugely, wildly successful. Like as, as big as sort of Noel Coward was when he first made a splash. And yet, and yet. Our feeling has always been that if she'd been a man, that you would know her name in the same way that you know Ibsen or Chekhov. Of course, when the Rutherford and Son was first done, very first done, it wasn't even known that she was a woman. It was billed as KG Sowerby, and the reviews were fantastic. As soon as it became clear that KG stood for Catherine Geetha, it suddenly became clear that, that her press reception was going to be less favourable. I'd never heard of this playwright before, and I kind of wondered why I hadn't. What she has to say is, is, is so relevant, and I know that's a word that we say about a lot of plays. It takes a very, very critical look a cold, hard stare, if you like, at the patriarchy and capitalism and industrialisation and what that does to family relationships. I think the way she writes um, women, what she has to say, her voice is so powerful. So we found a way of dramatising what in, in many instances goes not only undramatised but unnoticed. The fact of these individual women taking steps that they didn't think that they were capable of taking at the beginning of the play. Reading it, it never felt like a dusty play from a different era. It very much felt like a play that its sort of um, heart was still beating really strongly, even now. She was so brilliant. It just seems utterly right that, that she should be uh, given this platform on, on the national stage.